Hello my beautiful friends, it's Amanda here and it's been a hot minute since I did a dupes video. So today I'm going to share some dupes with you for really popular liquid lipsticks. And I just want to say a couple words about dupes before we get into the lip colors. I think the word dupe means different things to different people. For me, I'm just sharing matte liquid lipsticks that have a really, really similar color. Some of them I think are really exact on me. Others are super duper close. And in general, I think that being really, really close in shade is good enough for me. If you're going to buy an affordable alternative to a more expensive liquid lipstick, I don't think that it has to be 100% exactly the same because you're not gonna wear both at the same time. The whole point for me for an affordable dupe is to get something that looks the same and when you wear it, you really can't tell a difference in the shade. And when it comes to formula, I don't think these are exactly the same either. It just stands to reason that a three or five dollar liquid lipstick isn't gonna perform the same as a twenty dollar liquid lipstick, but when you get a matte lip color, as long as it's matte and long wearing, I really think that's close enough for me to call it a dupe. I am not shading any of the companies or any of the lipsticks that I'm duping. In fact, I'm really talking about them because they are my favorites and I recommend them so frequently that I want to give an alternative for those people out there who can't or won't pay $20 for a liquid lipstick. I 100% understand that and that's why I'm making this video. I really want to offer an alternative to those lip colors that I love and I recommend all the time. All of the affordable alternatives that I'm going to be offering today come from either the Wet n Wild Liquid Catsuit Liquid Lipstick line or the Matte Liquid Lip Colors from LA Colors. The Wet n Wild are $4.99 each and the LA Colors are only $3 each. So all of these dupe shades are $5 or less. When I swatch, I'll do a swatch on the back of my hand and I'll also show you the colors side by side on my lips. I'll do the higher priced item on this side and then the affordable alternative on this side. And I'll do a close up too so that you'll be able to see the similarities and if there are any differences, you'll be able to see that as well. Okay, the first dupe we're starting out with actually are both really affordable lines, one from the Wet n Wild Liquid Cat Suit and one from the LA Colors Matte Liquid Lip Color. However, they were so, so similar, I had to share them. And the LA Colors one is about $2 cheaper, so still a good dupe, saving $2, I'll take it any day. These are the shades Nudie Patootie and Au Natural. Next up, we have one of my favorite liquid lipsticks. It's the Too Faced Melted Matte. I love the formula on these. I still think they're the best liquid lipstick out there. But if you're looking for an affordable alternative to the Melted Matte shade Child Star, then LA Colors has you covered with the shade Sultry, only three bucks. I do think that the LA Colors shade Sultry is a little bit more peachy, whereas Child Star is more pinky, and I think that's more apparent in the hand swatch than it is on the lips. I do think these end up looking super similar once they're applied to the lips. Now we have these super fun, bright coral shades. On this side is the Too Faced Melted Matte in the shade Feeling Myself. And the dupe is the Wet n Wild Liquid Cat Suit in the shade Coral Corruption. I do think the Wet n Wild shade is slightly darker. I think that shows up more on a hand swatch than it does on the lips. But I do think these are super close. And if you want to explore a coral lip for summer, but you don't want to drop $20 on it, this is a really great way to do it. Speaking of super bright, fun shades, we have Backstage Bambi from Kat Von D, 
And then this one's called Oh My Dolly from Wet n Wild. These are so similar and I know this isn't really the everyday go-to type of color for most people. So it is nice to have an affordable alternative for this kind of shade. If you know it's not something that you're going to be using a lot, you may want to spend a little bit less on a shade like this. However, we all know the Kat Von D formula is amazing. I do think her liquid lipsticks are worth every penny, but it's just not in the budget for everybody. So if you wanna try this shade, there is a great alternative from Wet n Wild. Next up are two of my favorite berry shades. On this side we have Bend and Snap from the Too Faced Melted Matte line. And over here is the Wet n Wild Liquid Cat Suit in the shade Berry Recognize. I do think, again, the hand swatch looks a little bit more dissimilar than once they're actually applied to the lips. On the hand swatch, you'll see that the Wet n Wild shade is a little bit more red, whereas the Too Faced one is more of like a pinky berry. But again, on the lips, I think these look pretty much exactly alike. Now we're gonna get into some really deep, kind of vampy colors. First up is the MAC Retro Matte Liquid Lip Color in the shade Carnivorous. This is probably one of my favorite vampy shades that I've ever worn. And the dupe comes from LA Colors. It's the shade Danger. I do wanna go ahead and point out that the MAC Retro Matte is a lot more evenly pigmented. I only needed one coat to make my lips look fully opaque. And this side took about two, kind of three-ish. So you'll see in the hand swatch because it's only just one pass over that Carnivorous is quite a bit more pigmented and less streaky, but when it comes to a color match, these are so dang close. Next up, we have another Too Faced Melted Matte. This one's in the shade Drop Dead Red, and the color dupe comes from Wet n Wild, and this one's called Video Vixen. Okay guys, last one. On this side we have the Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in the shade Mother. And on this side is the LA Colors shade Perfection. I do think the LA Colors shade looks a teeny tiny bit cooler, especially again in the hand swatch. I do think these look pretty much exactly alike on the lips. So if you're not ready to invest $20 in a liquid lipstick or as is so often the case with Kat Von D's lipsticks, if this one's out of stock, then you can always try the LA Colors shade. So that wraps up today's video. I really hope that this one was helpful for you. Again, no shade towards any of these companies. I will continue to purchase and recommend from all of the brands that I talked about today. And I do think all of these are great lipsticks, but at the end of the day, I really wanna provide as much information for you as possible. And I know a lot of folks out there just really don't want to or can't possibly spend a whole lot on one lipstick. So I do like to provide an alternative for you. And again, I hope it helps. Leave all your dupe requests in the comments. And if you found a great dupe recently, leave that for us too so that we can go and check it out. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. I know that there are gonna be people that say like, oh, that's not a dupe. I know, I know they're not the same. That's why one costs $20. I know that, like, I'm sorry. I can't do anything about it. I got a bug bite and I'm gonna have like a flaming red spot 
on my face as I lip swatch. Awesome. Just my luck. Liquid lipstick dance. You get way too excited about makeup. Calm down. Boom. Beat that. So let's swatch. Swatch party. Swatch party. Four F F L L H. How very fluorescent you are today. The eh, hmm. I know that my lips look super crooked and part of that is just, it's really hard to do a whole bunch of liquid lipstick swatches in a row and make them all look perfect. I don't know how people do it, but part of it is just that this lip actually, my bottom lip is super uneven. And when I wear a really dark color, I think it points it out more and I don't want to like overline and correct it because I have to keep swatching more color so I don't want like liquid lipstick on my actual face. So I have crooked lips. It's all right. It's all right. And the eh, oh, ah. Don't they look the same? Mm, they do though. Mm, they do though. Distracting myself. I have no one to blame. Just me. Damn it. Even I have no idea what's gonna come out of my mouth sometimes. <laughs> sometimes it's a problem. Oops. I'm on the struggle bus today. Was the trick. Huh? <laughs> I'm 